Hello everyone, Pickbit here, and today we're playing a missing salesman. The game starts us off in the middle of nowhere at a bus stop. I know these kind of stops exist, but usually they're at a fork in a road, in, from my experience, because there are multiple bus lines going to different roads. Not something like this. Oh well. I finally got home from work. There doesn't seem to be anything to eat at home. I should go to the store. Okay, we're supposed to buy pizza. I have no clue why we're going to a store in the middle of the woods. With no other human around. Not even sure how such a store would make enough money to stay open. Like really. From the bus stop to here, not a single house and nothing around the store either. Strange. Okay. Quaint little store you've got here. Where's the freezer? There's the freezer. Okay. Why is that pizza just laying there unpackaged? Sure. That's sanitary. Hello, I'd like to buy pizza. Good evening. Sure, that will be $10. Okay. Thank you for buying. Enjoy your evening. You too. And I can still talk to him. It's the same dialogue. I expected him to warn me about some kind of serial, serial killer being around. And do I go back to the bus stop or... Is my house somewhere in that direction? Also, I still have thoughts about that pizza. I really hope I don't eat it, but... Knowing myself... It's likely that I will. Okay. We live in the middle of nowhere, it seems. And with that, I mean... It seems the road ends here and has trees growing out of it. That's normal. Right? Nothing strange going on. Well, home sweet home. And... These doors push you away. Hmm. I wonder. I really wonder if I stand here and open this door, will I be pushed through the wall? Should I try it? Yeah. And... Yep. I'm inside the wall. Can I get out of the wall? I don't think so. Oh well, this didn't take long, so just have to do it again. Okay, I'm back at home, and this time I want to see what's behind the doors without getting stuck in a wall. If I could open them... Why is there an outline for a paper roll or something? That's strange. And these two, these two doors are unavailable. Okay. Ask eat pizza, but I can't put it anywhere. I took it out of the freezer in the store. Why would you think you could just eat it like this? Ah, sure. The hitbox for eating pizza was over here. Interesting. And why did Satan come and decorate and light up my room? And I'm not sure if that door was supposed to be open or not. You know, with the red light, it would have been more ominous if it was closed. And I still can leave. From the inside, everything looks a little bit reddish. At least, 
anything you could say is made of glass or plastic. Ah, plastic maybe not, but... You get what I mean. Hey, safe baby. Is that the shopkeeper? That guy looked similar to the shopkeeper. And now we have a bunch of random stuff floating around. Hey? Who are you? Okay, we have that sound. This voice is creepy, but a little bit overdone at this point. What does that mean? How can you be me? Yeah. So I'm going to grow like 50%. And I'm trapped in this room. Interesting. I can only go to sleep. Sleep. Dot dot dot. Put the dirty laundry in the washer. Still disgusted how I ate the pizza roll without heating it up. Like, it wouldn't surprise me if that dream, or whatever I had just now, was just a bad trip from some, some kind of mushroom that gr has grown on the pizza. Okay. Shower combined with... The washer. Interesting. I want to get closer to that rubber ducky. It has a top hat. And that is amazing. Okay. Why is the toilet roll over here? And where is the dirty laundry? Confused? Yes, I am. Mm. Hmm. Unless I clicked on the dryer. Nope. Oh. I'm blind. Put the toilet paper in the toilet. Okay. Go to the store. I'm getting confused because... This is not running. And I've just woken up and it's still dark outside. So I might not even live in reality anymore. Mr. Storekeeper. I want to buy some stuff. Hi. Hey, the store's closed. Why? Did something happen? The salesman couldn't get to work. Something must have happened to him. Okay, I'll come back later. Go home. Surprise attack. How did you wait me? Man, you must have reflexes like a... I don't know. Cheetah? I'm inside you. How does it feel? Oh god. And... missing. Is that the guy that was at our home? Wait, that was my idea when I saw him the first time already. I just thought that guy was the same guy. Okay, I'm blacking out. Okay. So... Giant hand. Can you scratch my back? Yeah, that spot. Very nice. Okay, can I go to the bus stop? Probably, but I don't think that would do anything. Ah, so many hands. And there I am. If I can trust it. Why did I run away? 
Is that supposed to be a dead body? It is. Well, hi. You've got a dark spot next to your face. Very strange, but sure. Okay. I think I might have killed him and killed myself. And this is really not reality anymore. My name is Bob. I'm 27 years old and I'm schizophrenic. I'm tired of living like this. I think I killed the store clerk. I can't tell reality from illusion. And tonight, the 29th, 2016, I'm gonna kill myself. Oh yeah, I'm the big dark thing. So I'm in purgatory. Well, this was an interesting game, even if some of the walking parts were too long. Really unnecessary. If you just wanted to tell the story, you could have placed the buildings closer to each other. Oh well, I still enjoyed it, and I hope you enjoyed this video too. If you did, like, comment, or subscribe, it would be greatly appreciated. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!